Hi, my name is Natchi Butler. Cycling had everything to do with my recovery because continuing to cycle and to focus on a, a challenge um, stopped me going to some really dark places when I got diagnosed with cancer. It helped me get out of bed in the morning, stopped me from feeling sorry for myself. It's helped me so much. It really, really has. I've cycled in Vietnam, from Vietnam to Cambodia. I've cycled across India and um, in October this year I'll be cycling across Costa Rica. Some of the girls that I've met on the cancer challenges and um, we've become known as the pink lipstick ladies because when I was really ill and, uh, and I'd lost all my hair from chemotherapy the what was really important to me was to have the pink lipstick on so that helped my face have some identity but we sort of extended that to tutus and to wigs so the pink wigs come out when we're doing the cycle challenges along with the tutus. It probably took me about two years to feel really like I did before the cancer, but now I feel stronger and, um, and I've been amazed about what my body can do. Um, last year I cycled 5,200 miles. It's pretty good for a 59 year old. <laughs> Don't think that you'll not be good enough. Don't think that you can't do it. Um, because I was that woman, um, four years ago. You know, I could only cycle a few miles and now I can cycle hundreds of miles. If I can do it, anybody could do it. I want you to believe in yourself and believe that you too can get from cycling what I've got from cycling.